Welcome to Infigyan friends. Today in this video we are going to take up one very interesting system of equations. Given equations are cube root x plus cube root y equal to 1 x square plus y square is equal to 65. We have to find out all real solutions. So let's get started by writing our equation number 1 and equation number 2. Now I will use substitution. So I will consider cube root x equal to a and cube root y suppose it is equal to b. See after substitution our equation will change. How it would be? Equation number 1. It will be a plus b equal to 1. Now equation number 2. So x square is required, y square is required. We will consider the first equation from here. After taking cube, x is equal to a cube, y is equal to b cube. So from here we can write x square is equal to a power 6. And from this equation, y square we can write, it is b power 6. So second equation will become a power 6 plus b power 6 equal to 65. Now this is radical free system of equation. We will solve using these two. Let me write here equation 1 a plus b equal to 1 and equation 2 a power 6 plus b power 6 equal to 65. Now let us consider first equation and I will presume let a b equal to suppose k. So I will consider first equation a plus b equal to 1 is squaring both sides a plus b whole square. So a square plus b square plus 2ab equal to 1. ab is k as per substitution. So I can write from here a square plus b square is equal to 1 minus 2k. This result we will use straight away. Now I will write a power 6 plus b power 6 equal to 65 equation. Let me write here. Now a power 6 we can write it is a square whole cube. b power 6 it would be b square whole cube equal to 65. Now a cube plus b cube formula. Let me write here a cube plus b cube it is equal to a plus b times a square plus b square minus a b. Let us apply. So I will be writing a square plus b square in the very first bracket and then I will be writing a power 4 plus b power 4 minus a square b square and right hand side is 65. Now let us apply algebraic identities. So I will be writing a square plus b square in second bracket a power 4 plus b power 4 minus a square b square equal to 65. Now I can write a square plus b square as per our equation it is 1 minus 2k. So let us put the value of a square plus b square. 1 minus 2k. Okay, now this bracket here I can write again a square plus b square form expression. How it is? a square plus b square whole a square. So it is a power 4 plus b power 4 plus 2a square b square. So compensate that I have to write here minus 2a square b square. Then after it is minus a square b square. Bracket close 65. Now I can write 1 minus 2k. In this bracket I will write a square plus b square whole square. So 1 minus 2k whole square minus 3a square b square. So 3ab we have substituted k. So I will write k square. 
equal to 65. Now I will expand this. I will write 1 minus 2k whole cube minus 3k square 1 minus 2k and equal to 65. Now let us apply a minus b whole cube formula. So I will write a cube minus b cube. So minus 8a cube minus 3a square b. So I will write minus 6k and plus 3ab square. So I will write 12k square minus 3k square plus 6k cube and I will take minus 65 to LHS right hand side will be 0. Now this will come out one cubic equation. So minus 2k cube minus 8k cube plus 6k cube plus 9k square minus 6k minus 64 it is equal to 0. Now let's multiply this equation with negative 1. So I will be writing 2k cube. Then I will write minus 9k square. Then plus 6k plus 64. Let's use rational root theorem. So we will find out the factors of constant coefficient 64. So we can write plus minus 1 plus minus 2 plus minus 4 plus minus 8 and so on. And if I will put k equal to 1, it won't satisfy 2 minus 9 plus 6 plus 64. It is not. If I will put k equal to minus 1, again it will not because 64 is big number. Now let us put k equal to negative 2. So I will be writing 2 times k cube. So minus 8 minus 2 cube it is. Minus 9 times minus 2 square. So I will write straight away 4 plus 6 times k, so minus 12 plus 64. If you will check this negative minus 16 minus 36 minus 12. If you will add these three, it is negative 64. So it is making our equation 0. That means k equal to negative 2 is our base solution. Let us use synthetic division method. So I will write this is our base solution. Let's write the coefficient of cubic equation. So I will write 2, negative 9, 6 and 64. Leading coefficient as it is 2. Now let's multiply with the negative 2, with 2. So negative 4, negative 13, negative 2 times negative 13, 26, 32. Negative 2 times 32, 64 with negative sign, 0. So here we are having coefficient for quadratic equation. So I will write 2k square minus 13k plus 32 equal to 0. Now I will check only discriminant. So delta, as per formula it is b square minus 4ac value. So b square is negative 13 square. So I will write 169 minus 4 times 2, 8, 8 times 32. So 256. So this is negative value. So complex solution will generate from here. So we will reject this equation for our solution as we are calculating real solutions. So far accepted solution is k equal to negative 2. Now what was k? k was our substitution. It was ab. So let us write ab equal to negative 2. And our first equation was a plus b equal to 1. Now this is easy system. We will solve this system easily. Sum of roots, product of roots. This is sum of roots, product of roots. So I can frame one equation in its variable a itself a square minus sum of roots 1 times a and plus product of roots so minus 2 equal to 0. Now I can factorize it. I will write a plus 1 times 
a minus 2. So it will give us right hand side 0. From here we can conclude a equal to negative 1 and a equal to 2. Now I can write the value of b from here. So b will be equal to as a plus b is 1. So I can write b is equal to 2 here for this set and b equal to negative 1 for this set. So we can write a comma b it would be negative 1 comma 2 and 2 comma negative 1. Now we are calculating actually the value of x and y. So what was x? So let me write here x comma y. So we can write x comma y equal to it is a cube and b cube. So I will write minus 1 cube minus 1 2 cube 8 2 cube 8 minus 1 cube minus 1. So this is our final and ultimate answer for this challenging system of equations. I hope friends this video will be meaningful to you. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself. Bye-bye.